welcome back everyone. It's been a couple of weeks. We've had serious storms here. Just took our roofs. Mott River's been high, there's been floods. The winds have been like hurricanes. So I haven't been able to get near a river for a fortnight. And this is sort of the first calm day we've had. Thanks to all my new subscribers, whether you've come from Lost Mines or, or, or from anywhere else really. Two hours later. Here I am trying to find my way down to the, the river, hopefully down in the valley here somewhere. Lovely day. It's an adventurous day. This is another new prospect. I've never been here before, so I'm just trying to navigate my way down to the river. After my war with the brambles, I made it down to the riverside. Um, what a big riverbed here, full of gravel. I'm going to walk upstream and try and find some bedrock where it's nice and easy to try and find some shiny. Can get some good gold here, right? Today, though, so we've just got to find a suitable crevice that's not too in the water because it's freezing. Let's see how we get on. My favourite type of quartz rocks. Nice and dirty looking. Especially that one. When you see them, you know you're in for a good time. You look in the right place. So we come down here, it is an inside bend sort of thing, and there's a lot of tree rooty big boulders in there. Low, I don't know if it's on a slant, there won't be nothing there, but if it's one of them, I think I've got to try. So we're going to give it a go. It's like a nap. I didn't see that while I was there. Loose bedrock here going straight across the river. Oh, I love new rivers, especially when you find gold in them. Look at the sun, it's the first day of spring as far as I'm concerned. So I've just took my first pan out of there. 
and there's one speck in the first pan. One tiny speck, one tiny speck there. See that orange staining in the bedrock at the side there? That's you usually get gold associated with that in this area. Big old quartz stone stuck down there. So we, we're not at the bottom yet. We're only getting fine specks so but they are fine specks so it's here. Let's see if we can find anything bigger. So I dug that sort of crevice out, looking for the proper crevice. It was all semi-compact. I was getting some lot small specks of gold in the top layer and then I dug through it and there was nothing and I got to the bottom of the bedrock, started chasing it and there's just nothing there so I'm not going to waste any more time Try somewhere else The quartz rock is appealing to me in the centre of the river there so I'm going to set the sluice up at the side of it pull that quartz rock out of the way and uh, uh, do a few pans through the sluice from under that quartz rock, see if we have any luck with that. So after moving the quartz rock, we still not finding any compacted material. Uh, so I'm going to sluice it a bit and see, but probably not, not going to be much happening here either. Beautiful spot though. That's the end of this prospect. I've got one more little long flake out of that and a few specks. So these are the sort of quartz rocks I'm coming across today. Uh, mineralized with iron by the main looks of it. I don't know what the other stuff is mixed in that quartz. But there ain't no gold, I know that. It's me naked. That's good and new explore. Didn't find much, but I did find gold. Very fine specks high up the stream and one decent speck lower down. So we'll investigate lower down next time. So it's a new one on the list. Brilliant. Hope you enjoyed watching. It's a beautiful place.